To allow others to see your calendar appointments or make appointments for you, calendars must be shared. To share a calendar, go to the calendar application. To share the default calendar, choose the first calendar in the list named Calendar. From the drop-down menu, select Share Calendar. The Share Properties dialog box opens and allows selection of privileges. External Guests is a view-only calendar and requires a password for the individual to view the calendar. Entering the email address of the sender and a password will send an email and the link to view the calendar. Public Share simply supplies the URL to be shared with whomever you choose. To share with internal users or groups allows for others to be able to both view and manage your calendar, which includes scheduling appointments. Enter the email addresses of those to share with. Select the role. Viewer is a view-only calendar. Recipients will add their calendar to their calendar section and they can see any appointments you add, but they cannot edit your calendar. Manager allows those who share the calendar to edit appointments, add appointments, accept appointments, and remove appointments. Admin gives all the same privileges as manager, but also allows anyone who currently shares your calendar to share it with others. Checking Allow Users to See My Private Appointments will make the whole calendar visible to shares no matter what preferences are set in the individual appointment. A standard message is sent to sharers that states the calendar has been shared with them and what their privileges are. Additional information can be added to the message. Sharers must accept the share for the calendar to appear and be viewed in their calendar application. Sharing privileges can be revoked by right-clicking on any calendar that has been shared and selecting Edit Properties. The sharing privileges appear in the Properties window. Owners can edit or change the properties, revoke them completely, which will make the calendar unviewable in the sharer's application, or resend a notice if the share has not been accepted or if the file did not go through.